What is up, people? Mr. Falior here, bringing you another video. Welcome back. RuneScape. Of course, first things first. I gotta use my key up. Two lamps. Very nice. Both crafting, of course. Boom! Leveled up crafting. Hell yeah! I need as much of that as I can. Since it takes forever. Okay, in this video, we're going to be doing a quest and a mini quest. Sheep Shearer. Technically no longer a quest. It is a mini quest. So I gotta talk to Fred the Farmer. Who I believe is right in here. Oh shoot. Sorry about that. What are you doing on my land? You're not the one who keeps leaving all my gates open and letting all my chickens out, are you? Uh, I'm looking for something to kill. What? On my land? Leave my livestock alone. I'm lost. How can you be lost? Just follow the road east and south. You'll end up in Lumbridge fairly quickly. <coughs> Damn it. I'm looking for work. Oh. Well, I could do with a bit of help since you're offering. I need to collect some black wool from my sheep and I'd be much obliged if you could shear them for me. While you're at it, spin the wool in the balls for me too. Does it have to be black wool? Has to be. I'm doing business with some guy after black clothing. Something to do with black looking cool. It takes all sorts, I suppose. Indeed. So if you could bring me 20 balls of black wool, I'm sure I could sort some sort of payment. So is this a quest? No, it isn't. It's work. You do what I say, then you get paid. Good. Hopefully you'll be safe from the thing. Do you actually know how to shear sheep? What do you mean the thing? Well, now, no one has ever seen the thing. That's why we call it the thing. Because we don't know what it is. Some say it's a black-hearted shapeshifter. Hungering for the souls of decent, hard-working folk like me. Others say it's just a sheep. Well, I don't have all day to stand around and gossip. Did you say you knew how to shear sheep? Of course. And you know how to spin wool in the balls? I'm something of an expert, actually. Well, you can stop grinning and get to work, then. I'm not paying you by the hour. I, I honestly didn't expect to... um do a voice I just decided to do it and it stick stuck stick stuck oh no get back here get back here sheepy there we go there's only two black sheep in the whole area so I gotta wait oh the little black lamb running around that's cute Guess I gotta keep going back and forth, huh? Shear sheep. Shear sheep. Nope, not the white one. There we go. Back over here where the other sheep is. Ruby, what are you doing? Now oh, come back here, damn it. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. That's kind of funny, though. In the same video, I'm shearing sheep and gonna kill a big demon that's about to th destroy all of Varrock. Isn't that great? Okay. 
They need a few more than just two black sheep in here if he wants black sheep. Or black wool. Why didn't they change it to black wool anyway? He has a ton of white wool. Okay. We're at 12. Eight more to go. Naked sheep. Naked sheep. Naked sheep. Naked sheep. Really? Manages to get away. Oh my gosh. Stop getting away. Cut it out. Okay. Manages to get away. Thank you. Dang, these sheep. At least they grow their wool back instantly. Or almost instantly. <laughs> that would be kind of funny if, they, if there was ever a medieval movie where they have that as an Easter egg where you just see some dude full suit of armor just shearing sheep in the background. That would be really funny. It'd be a little nod to RuneScape. Okay. Closest one I know of is in the castle. So let's quickly go in the castle, shall we? Hurry up. Okay, if you're going over here, then I'm going to this one. Oh yeah, I don't need to go to the top floor, so just a regular normal click. Uh, not the door, stupid. Come on. There you go, let's spin them. Not much XP. I don't even think I'm going to level up on it. Dang. Okay. Back to Fred. Hey, it's Fred. Oh God, how many how many memories have brought back you guys? Hey, it's Fred. Except much more high pitched. Okay, Fred. Here's your wool. I have some balls of black wool for you. Give them here, then. That's the last of them. A pleasure doing business, would you? You can shear my sheep whenever you want. You could even sell the wool on the Grand Exchange. But that's the white ones only, mind you. Anyway, I guess I better pay you. Woo, 2,000 coins and 150 crafting XP. Still not enough to even level up once. Dang. Oh, someone's killing his chickens. Uh oh. Soccer keep 84. Why are you killing his chickens? <laughs> okay. That's done. Time for Demon Slayer. Talk to Gideon Bade at the Ceredomist, Ceredomist Church in Northeast Farrock. Okay, sounds good to me. Let's go. I don't think I need a quest guide for it. But you never know with this kind of thing. There will definitely 100%
be times where I will be using a quest guide on my phone for some members quests because holy hell I don't know how anybody has ever done them without a guide because um, some of them have some puzzles in there that have been known to upset a few people. <laughs> Gideon Bade, there he is. In the name of Sarah Doman, I beseech you, assist me. I have come to this place seeking a dangerous fugitive. He has stolen a formidable demonic tome, one that could spell the end of this entire city. Help me to stop him, please. You'll help? Pray, Sarah Doman. I knew you looked righteous. We don't have much time, so listen carefully. I am pursu pursuing Deneth, a dangerous and unstable wizard. Deneth infiltrated Edgeville Monastery and stole a tome of demonology from my order. The book was once used to summon Delareth, an ancient demon from the infernal dimensions. Delareth has the power to demolish cities and is impervious to all forms of attack save one, the Holy Sword Silverlight. Silverlight rests in the crypt beneath this very church, watched over by the spirits of its former owners. I've tracked Deneth to this city, but I lost his trail. While I hunt him down, I need you to retrieve the sword. Should Delareth return to this world, or Delrith, return to this world, Silverlight shall be our only salvation. Climb down the trapdoor to the south to enter the crypt beneath this church and retrieve Silverlight. Who are you? I am Gideon Bade, an occult scholar and caretaker of Edgeville Monastery's modest library. Abbot Langley entrusted the Tome of Demonology to me. It is my fault that Deneth now has it. Though I could not hope to best Deneth in battle, it is my duty to try and stop him. Tell me about Deneth. Deneth is a madman who claims to worship Zamorak. Deneth reveal, revels in destruction and is binded by his lust for power. He could call he would call forth a demon that could just as easily kill him and everyone in Varrock, as do his bidding. Deneth is insane and to be approached very cautiously. Tell me about Delrith. Delrith is an ancient and powerful demon. This is not the first time he has entered our world. A hundred and fifty years ago, a legendary hero battled Delrith and banished him beneath or back to Infernus. Tell me about Silverlight. Silverlight is the only weapon that can harm Delrith and is interred within the crypt beneath this very church. We must secure Silverlight in case the worst would come to pass. Why have you not already retrieved Silverlight? I tried, but the Holy Sword is guarded by the spirits of the dead, three brave souls that wielded Silverlight in life. I faced the spirits' trials, but was judged unworthy. I am but an academic. I cannot stop Deneth without your help, hero. Goodbye. Okay, so I gotta go down the trapdoor. <coughs> Ooh, and dark down here, huh? Ooh. Do I have a cat hair in my mouth? Yeah, I do. My mouse was turning a different way than where I was telling it to. It looks really cool down here. I like the lighting. Spirit of faith, spirit of body, spirit of mind. Welcome. 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 I come seeking... Oh, no. Who are you? 
We are the guardians of this place. We are the spirits of three who wielded silver light. We protect the holy sword. Ah, that's creepy. What is creepy? That. Ha. 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 <laughs> I come seeking silver light. If you wish to wield silver light, you must pass the three trials. The trial of the body in the west, the trial of faith in the north, and the trial of the mind in the east. Seek us there when you are ready. That's pretty cool. <coughs> Altar that holds silver light. Guess body first. Spirit of the body. The trial of the body will show you have the strength to properly wield silver light. A powerful weapon can easily be wrested from weak arms. Yes, begin. The trial of the body is to clean up these bones. That's it. Do not underestimate the trial. Manual labor can be hard work. Got him. Got him. They all have 50 health, so yeah. That's pretty simple. Probably simple even at level 1. You have completed the trial. I will wait for you in Silverlight's chamber. Okay. Now Faith is next, I think. Yep. <clears throat> the trial of faith demonstrates that you believe in the power of the gods to guide you. Without faith, silver light will be powerless in your hands. The trial of faith is simple. You must cross this chasm. How can I do that? There's no way across, and it's a long way down. I will tell you the path you must walk. Do not believe your eyes. Each step you take will be a step of faith. Okay. Step north. Okay. North. East. East. North. 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 Oh. Almost said twice. West. West. South, west, west, north, north, north. I did it. Oh, you have complete. Oh my god. I missed it. I don't know what he said. You have completed something, the faith something. I'm sorry. I thought I had to finish walking. Spirit of the mind, the trial of the mind will prove that you are focused on your task and understand what lies ahead of you. You cannot be trusted with silver light if your mind is clouded. Why are you in this place? I seek silver light, grave robbing. I like hanging out in crypts. I seek silver light. And what is silver light? A musical trope. A magical candle, a sword that slays demons. Why do you require a sword that slays demons? Why don't you need a sword that slays demons? That one's actually really funny. A powerful demon threatens Varrock. It will look nice in my weapon rack. Honestly, why don't you need a sword that slays demons? You know, you never know. Okay, a uh, powerful demon threatens Varrock. Who is this demon? Delrith, Samurai Gideon Blade. Delrith. And who sends you to claim Silverlight and fight Delrith? Zamorak Denith, Gideon Blade. It's Gideon Blade. Your mind is focused. The trial of mind is complete. You have completed the trial. I will wait for you in Silverlight's chamber. Yay. I did it. 
You passed the trial of the body. You have proven your str- you have s- the strength to wield silver light. You have passed the trial of the mind. You have proven your mind unclouded and clear. You have passed the trial of faith. The gods smile upon you and will guide the blade in your hands. You are worthy to wield silver light. Farewell, hero. Ooh. There it is. Silver light. Finally. Heck yeah. You have claimed silver light. I got it. It does less damage, but it's good. Magical sword silver light. Boom. That looks really pretty though, doesn't it? I am out. I have gotten it. Oh, read scroll. <coughs> Hero, I have located Denneth. He seeks to summon Delroth right here in Varrock. Denneth is beneath the Temple of Zemrock in the southeast part of Varrock. Look for a trap door, much like the one in this church. I will meet you there. Make haste, Gideon Bade. Ooh. It's either Gideon Bade or Gideon Bidet, and that's kind of funny. If you could call him Gideon Bidet. <clears throat> He'll help clean your butthole. I'm sorry. I just had to say it. I can't not say it, you know. I don't have any food. Good. Uh, let me take these shrimp. I think I see a thing I can cook and let me cook. No, but I can over here. Okay. Whose house can I cook in? Yours? Oh, it's a tramp. I'm gonna just cook in your house real quick, if you don't mind. Hello, Moki, what are you doing? I don't know if you heard her in the background, she's talking. Okay, I burnt two of them, that's fine. <coughs> I probably won't need the shrimp, but who knows. Take care, hero. This place is likely crawling with Dennis fanatics. Ooh. It's pretty. Oh, yeah. I should probably just wield the sword first. My normal sword. Cultus. Oh, boy. Oh. They drop cooked meat. That takes care of them. Let's move on. Cool. They had food. Is there no end to these extremists? Quickly, we must press on. Oh, shoot, I just realized I'm level 10 in strength. I need to switch that back to attack now. Uh, attack. Yes, please. Okay. Pick up the meat. Stop attacking me. I'm trying to pick up some meat first. Your friend's meat. Let's go. <laughs> the noises they make. That's the last of them. Hurry, find Deneth before it's too late. Hold on. Let me pick up some more meat. And there it is. Arise, O mighty Delrith. Bring distraction to this soft, weak city. Denneth, stop! Well, well, if it isn't Gideon Bade, 
I'm surprised you had the nerve to pursue me. You should have stayed in Edgeville, bookworm. You're already too late. Behold! Diabolica fra Fratri. With cleansing fire, I break the seal that binds thee. No! Ha ha ha! The demon is unbound! I'd love to stay and witness your annihilation, but I'd best be far away from when Delrith incinerates Varak. Farewell. I hope you brought Silverlight, hero. Steal yourself. I'm free. This world will burn. Starting with you. Third Omen, shield us. Ah! Oh. What? I must rest to shield us again. Okay. Hero, slay Delrath now! Got him. I got it. Prepare it to be incinerated. Oh, shoot. Oh, yeah, I gotta... Oh. He does damage to me even when I'm in the shield. I forgot that. Get him. Stab him. There you go. You're gonna incinerate me again, or at least attempt to. Get him. You're done. Delrith is defeated, but this place is coming apart. Let's get out of here. Well done, hero. Your actions saved not only myself, but all of Varrock from being turned to smoldering ash by Delrith. Here, you've certainly earned this. Heck yeah. I'm relieved that barrier I conquered actually worked. Mm. I never imagined I might have to protect us from a real demon. Farewell, my friend. Saradomen, watch over you. Cool. And I got a wand and book that are level one only. Oh my gosh. What's the point of that? Uh, I'm going to actually use this on range. Because why not? Yay! Ten range, heck yeah! Okay! Well, I have silver light, I defeated a demon, I sheared some sheep. All in a day's work. Cool. Well, looks like that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please like this video, subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you again next time. Bye.